back to engineer tech up channel so in this video we will discuss how to crack any interview or we can focus on many of manual tester or the people who is from different background like you are working in the support or you having the long gap and you are planning to make your profile as a experience level like a automation testing or you are learning the selenium right so in this video we have agenda how to crack any interview and another agenda is when you have to start your interview then you have a very less uh, chance to reject in your interview so that is the two things we will discuss in this video and we should not do lot of the mistakes and we can get a very less opportunity to you know reject in the interview i am not going to tell you you will 100% crack in one interview no uh sometime the interview panels or questions sometime might be you can not revise and you will get that question but you will get overall experience you have a very less opportunity to you know reject in the your interview so first of all many of the people are not getting the calls reason behind that you did not mention the proper skill set in your resume so that's why you are not getting the call that is the one things you have to take care your slavers what to learn many of them you don't know what to learn right blindly you are just attending the interview and you are not getting the call or you are getting the call or you are rejecting in your interview so first of all if you are planning for in automation profile as experience 3 to 5 year then you have to select one uh, programming language like java or python then selenium then cucumber then basics api testing then basics knowledge of sql or database or you have uh, some devops tool like jenkins maven and git so these are the things you have to prepare well then you will get or you can put this a skill in your resume and definitely you will get call 100% second thing when you have to start your interview right so just i can give you the example of core java so what you have to take care of the preparation of your core java so basics java concept like uh, you know i can give you the example of like variable like method so these are the basic concept you have to learn up concept you have to learn a strings you have to learn exception handling collection abstraction interface these are the important topics you have to learn in the depth not only for the theory you should able to implement the code as well that is the one things you have to take care second thing you have to take care basic selenium like you are do, you are learning the selenium right for basic selenium what you have to take care you have to learn basics uh, method like how to get text get title how to handle pop up how to handle mouse over event how to you know synchronization issue like beta statement then frames many you know whatever the basics things are there multiple window handles so these are the things you have to learn first then second you have to learn advanced selenium or framework component like in the framework component you have to learn page object model concept then you have to learn how to read the data from the excel apache poi concept then how to configure the extent report in your framework then you have to uh, you have to learn uh, test ng framework so these are the important things and you have to know how to build at least the basics framework structure after building the uh, you know framework after implementing the framework you can find any website and you can write around 100 test cases and try to automate all the test cases in your framework by using the framework so this thing the people are not doing and directly they are going for the interview and the interviewer will ask you as a experience can you explain your framework and how you are automating your manual test cases by using the framework right if you will not do this practice you will reject in your interview right so before going for the interview that is the key point you have to highlight you have to do the practice otherwise you will stuck in your interview 100% okay that thing you have to must you have to do if you are going as a 3 to 5 year of experience otherwise you will reject in your interview second thing what you have to take care okay apart from that i already explained you you know the you have a ba basics knowledge of cucumber because they will ask you did you work on the cucumber or not yes you you know how to create a feature file how to write the features file how to create a step definition how to create a test runner in uh, cucumber then you have a basics knowledge of uh, at least api testing 
you know postman and rest assured then you have a basics knowledge of you know sql then i'm going to tell you the hands on practice as well then you have a uh, all this git jenkins and maven so these are the things you have to highlight and that is very important apart from that you know this is your technical round apart from that we have a uh, some common questions so first question they will ask you tell me about yourself in the tell me about yourself here you have to highlight your uh, skill set as well and you have to highlight what the things you have done in your automation project that is the very important okay in tell me about yourself you have to highlight your a uh, skill set you have to highlight your automation uh, skill set and you have to highlight what is your contribution in your automation project so tell me about yourself guys whatever i will speak that uh, uh, questions i have already made the video on the real time interview question and answer please go through my channel we have a one playlist or i will uh, in the below link i will uh, you know in description i will mention the link as well for real time interview question and answer please note down this question definitely the interviewer will ask to you tell me about yourself you have to prepare well if you are showing as experience in automation or manual i have already made the a specific video of tell me about yourself then what is your roles and responsibility in your current project if you are showing experience as a automation then then what is your day to day activity then what the challenges you have faced in your automation profile so and what the process you are following in your like what is your agile methodology right what the challenges you have faced in your automation what type of the exceptions you have uh, you know you will get in your project while working right so these are the very common questions they will ask in your interview you have to prepare well just i can give you one example if the interviewer will ask you what is your roles and responsibility in your automation project and if you did not prepare well okay then you are not able to give the answer so this all the answer i have already made in one we have a one playlist so i will get all the common interview sorry real time interview question and answer please go through that and definitely you will get the proper explanation over there and definitely you will boost up your confidence then you can upload your profile in your nokri okay resume preparation is very important okay if you are showing as a experience in automation then whatever the skill set i have told you you have to highlight in your interview then apart from that if you having the notice period 3 months if you will put your notice period 3 months you will get very less call okay please put your notice period 45 to 60 days and update your profile in your nokri and update daily on the daily basis morning okay then your profile will be up then you will get the calls okay if you want to have more calls then you can create two nokri profile with two email id and phone number just you can put only one pic for one profile another pic you cannot make uh, you know you, you cannot put that uh, your pic if you want you can put it no problem at all then you can update daily basis then you will get the call as well so i have given you the road map how to start your interview what to do before going for the interview then you have a very less of a less possibility to reject in your interview and if you will attend the interview having the more confidence before attending the interview as well so thank you so much guys so uh, in this video i have shared my experience uh, there was no guidance and all how to start an interview and all but my failure i learned that then i am i thought i have to guide the people who is uh, in the same phase like they are planning to start the interview and they are planning to switch the company and all so again thank you so much for watching this video please share and subscribe my channel and press bell icon and definitely when you will press bell icon then you will get new video notification okay hope this video will help you helpful for you guys and please share with your needy people so it will help for them so thank you so much see you in the next video bye bye